All right, we have a very nice warm evening in play right now. Humidity levels are low. We're in for warmer days ahead and humidity levels will stay low for the next couple of days. But as we get into the weekend on into the day of the eclipse, the storms will be on the increase. Now let me show you a projection of what the cloud cover is supposed to be for the great eclipse. This is 1145. That's when it will be at its max around Albuquerque and we're calling for mostly cloudy skies, mainly high clouds. All we need is a break and that would improve things, but the best view in more around the four corners and less central and southeastern parts of the state. This will change day by day, so we'll be here to update you on it. It's not going to be as sunny as it's going to be tomorrow, though. Look at that. In the 90s with plenty of sunshine, Albuquerque, Rio Rancho, on into Santa Fe. So the seven day forecast with this dry air in play will be in the low 90s, so above normal temperatures for Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. See how that moisture starts to increase. Southern parts of New Mexico, along with temperatures in the 70s and 80s and 90s. Now, showers and thunder storms will spread northward in Albuquerque on in northern parts of the state Sunday into Monday and again Tuesday on into Wednesday. We'll have more coming up in just a bit. Doug Shelley.